Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, but... I'm guilty. Hey, fellas! Goofy! Goofy! You know, that really hurt. Aw, Goofy. Of course, Your Majesty. I get bumped on the head all the time. <laughs> with them. Hey! the guy that handsome. You mean it's his nobody? The leader of Organization 13. Wait a minute. Now I know. Wise Ansem, I am here to seek your advice. I'm glad we have the opportunity to speak like this, my friend. I'm intrigued by your hypothesis, and I'm finding it difficult to stave off the urge to test it. Still, I'm concerned about the stability of the worlds. Yup. That's what worries me, too. The doors that appeared. The place the heartless seek. I fear my research may have brought this upon us. Master Ansem. Regarding the experiment I presented the other day, with your permission, I'd like to proceed. I forbid it! Forget this talk of doors and the heart of all worlds. That place must not be defiled. But Master Ansem, I've been thinking... They are not. Those thoughts are best forgotten. Now I remember! Xehanort, Ansem's apprentice! The leader of Organization 13 is Xehanort's nobody! Let's go! Where's the king? Come on! Your Majesty! Xehanort! How long has it been since I abandoned that name? Out with it, nobody! Where's Kyrie? Where's Riku? I know nothing of any Kairi. As for Riku, perhaps you should ask your king. Stop! Oh. 
He's gone. What's going on? Way to fall right into their trap. It's a setup by Organization 13. Xemnas is using you to destroy the Heartless. That's his big master plan. Xemnas? The guy you just saw. He's their leader. Got it memorized? X-E-M-N-A-S. Organization 13 wants to get rid of the Heartless? Man, you're slow. Every heartless slain with that Keyblade releases a captive heart. That is what the organization is after. So what are those guys gonna do with your hearts? I'm not telling. Tell us! You! You're the one who kidnapped Kyrie! Bingo. The name's Axel. Got it memorized. Where is Kyrie? Please, just tell me! Look, about Kyrie, I'm sorry. Axel! Uh-oh! We'll ensure he receives the maximum punishment. I don't care about any of that! Just let me into the realm of darkness, okay? If it's Kyrie you're worried about, don't. We're taking very good care of her. Take me to her. Is she that important to you? Yeah, more than anything. Show me how important. Please. So, you really do care for her? In that case, the answer is no. You run! Are you angry? Do you hate me? Then take that rage and direct it at the Heartless. Pitiful Heartless, mindlessly collecting hearts. And yet, they know not the true power of what they hold. The rage of the Keyblade releases those hearts. They gather in darkness, masterless and free, until they weave together to make kingdom hearts. And when that time comes, we can truly finally exist. What in the world do you think you're prattling on about? Kingdom Hearts belongs to me. The heart of all kingdoms. The heart of all that lives. A dominion fit to be called Kingdom Hearts must be my dominion! Maleficent, no! No more Heartless! I do not take orders from you! Fool. Oh no! these creatures at bay, you devise a way to vanquish them forever. Maleficent. Do not misunderstand me. 
I shall have my revenge on you yet. Maleficent! Leave now! I don't take orders from you! But what about... Now then, where did we leave off? on anyway the heartless ally with whoever's the strongest yes Sora extract more hearts supposed to do if I can't use the Keyblade? Imbeciles! You can't be trusted to do anything. Huh? Sora! Donald! Goofy! Relax. Those three aren't going down that easily. The Keyblade's chosen one. He's a lucky kid. See you soon. Sora knows the truth now. The more heartless that he defeats, the closer he is to becoming our perfect puppet. This new knowledge will make him that much harder to control. What does it matter, really? Whatever his circumstances, Sora has never been able to help himself from saving people from the Heartless. It's what his pure little heart wants. There. The dice have been cast. Things are in motion. He can't stop this. Nothing is set in stone. If the dice aren't in your favor, it will share Demix's fate. The fun is in not knowing, isn't it? What is the point of betting on something if you already know the outcome? Are you sure that defeating him won't derail the organization's plan? If he is to die so easily, he is of no use to us. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. It's not in my nature to hold back. I guess sometimes help comes from unexpected places. Sure does. Maybe everything we've done, maybe it was all for nothing. What am I supposed to do if I can't use the Keyblade? Imbeciles! You can't be trusted to do anything! Huh? What's this place? It must be the realm of darkness. Kyrie, Riku. What? Who's that? Why was that? Are you sure you want to open that?
gorge. It's the gang from Twilight Town. There's Hainer, Pence, Olette, and, uh, um... Roxas. Yogarama! No. A name just popped into my head. This is... Roxas. Are you sure you want to eat... that? Salty. No. Sweet! Not yet. I gotta look for Kyrie. Photo and some ice cream. Hmm. Wonder if there's some sort of clue. And who would have left them for us anyway? Riku? You think? Just this feeling I got. Yeah! The robber's there! Hey, what if the Heartless are back again? I can't use the Keyblade. That would only help the organization. But Sora, I think you have to use it. If we don't fight them, the Heartless will keep on hurting folks. Liars! What? Leon doesn't have any treasure! And we fought for you guys. Donald! Well, I had to kill him something. I don't see how we're gonna work this out. So what should we do? We're just going to take your treasure. But we don't have anything. You sure? Hmm. Let's take a look. Okay, we've decided. The Gullwings are taking all your items. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, Foofy. This stinks. So not cool. Look, sorry we tricked you, but... Forget about it. Leon told us the whole story. He said your journey's been pretty rough. So it wouldn't really be right if we took your things. We'll root for you. Here, this is from us. Bye, good luck on your journey. Hi. Well, hello, Sora. Yes, hello there, somebody I don't know. Eeyore told me Pooh wasn't quite himself. I thought this might be just what the poor dear needed. Yeah, I hope it'll make Pooh better. His tears are wonderful things. The top of the middle of the river, the bottom of the middle of the <laughs> A present for me? <laughs> Why, presents are what Tigger's like best. And it's not even my birthday. <laughs> But, but Tigger, that's not for you. Wait, Tigger! Oh dear. Come on, let's go after him.
I bet you remember me now, don't you, Buddy Bear? Well, I remember that bouncing always makes me hungry. All that bouncing and he still doesn't remember me. Well, then I guess bouncing's not the answer. It makes a Tigger almost never want to bounce again. <laughs> Oh, please be careful with that. Oh, sorry, little piglet, but Pooh not remembering me has me confused. I don't even feel like bouncing. Oh, but Tigger, I always thought that bouncing was what Tiggers did best. Pooh boy, <gasps> you remember me. You do remember your old buddy Tigger after all. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. <laughs> I wonder who that is. Oh well, perhaps I'll remember tomorrow. Sebastian, it's just, it's not what I want to sing. <gasps> I want to sing about how our two worlds can live in harmony, land and sea together. The Sea King would make chowder out of me if you sang a song like that! If you won't listen, then I'm not going to sing at all. Uh, Ariel! How do I get myself into these situations? Oh, man. Not only has that girl fallen in love at the worst possible time, but with a human! Ariel's in love with a human? <gasps> oh, me and my big mouth! <laughs> 